Hi guys, uh, here we are at Clumber Park. Um, going to show today how we actually uh, do a time lapse uh, using the uh, Mimo app for the uh, DJI Osmo Mobile 3. So bear with me while we try and find a suitable uh, location. Here we have it. I think I found the spot. Uh, I'm heading down towards the lake. Um, let's just try and find the ideal place to set this up uh, just looking at a, a beautiful type of church up here okay uh, we're now in the time lapse function of the uh, Mimo app so as you see at the top there is a action box with a, a drop down function so if we uh, hit on that and drop it all down as you can see, it will allow us to set uh, intervals uh, up to oh, crikey, up to 60 second intervals. Uh, for the purpose of what I want to do now, I'll set it to about 4 seconds. Uh, you can also set it for a duration period, uh, up to 5 hours. I'm going to set this at 30 minutes. So another nice thing this can do uh, is uh, it will set a, you can set a path, a motion path uh, for the gimbal to follow during its time lapse recording. So if we hit the uh, path it will allow us to set up to four positions. So if we set this position first, uh, move the camera around using the gimbal joystick to another position, hit the uh, plus button again, move it again, record that position and set the final position and then we're all set to go. Uh, all we have to do now is hit the record button and the uh, gimbal will set to the first position and start recording. So there we have it. I've created a 14 second time lapse, uh, which took 30 minutes at uh, four seconds per frame. So hope you liked it. Well, I couldn't re uh, resist that last time lapse clip, so I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, that was taken in 20 minutes and uh, one frame per second. So I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, please subscribe and hit the like button. Bye bye for now.